So the vacuums that we have have variable speed. Um, as you can see, this switch right here, if it's pointed this way, it's at the max speed. But when we're doing any kind of cleaning on the objects, we want it to have as minimum um, speed as possible as far as we feel safe. Um, another thing, as you can see on the vacuum attachment here, there's this little part right here at the tube. And that can twist. And if the, the holes on the top of this are completely open, then the suction is going to be less. And that's also an ideal way to control the variable speed of the vacuum. We're going to have the tube attached as well. And at the end of the tube, we're going to include uh, cheesecloth, which we wrap twice, or this is wrapped twice, and we wrap it over the top while the vacuum's off. We put a rubber band on it to secure it. And the reason that we're using the cheesecloth is if we're cleaning an object and a little small fragment can come off, uh, we are going to be a little bit concerned about some of those objects, losing those objects altogether of the vacuum. So this is going to help us be aware of uh, the, frag the fragility of the object that we're cleaning and also be able to preserve any of those objects, if it, uh, materials that are falling off the object if we want to be able to put it back on the object later. This, there is a way to uh, hold the vacuum that makes it so if, if we are have the vacuum up like this on the object, you know, there's a chance, you know, as we're holding it, that maybe it falls and it knocks the object. It's really just kind of cumbersome to try to hold it this way. And we also need our other hands to do the cleaning while we're using the vacuum. So the way that we do it in conservation is we like to drape it over our shoulders like this and then hold it on your shoulder like this. And that way you can kind of control where the vacuum poses and it's not gonna be in your way as soon as you walk. And we can hold this vacuum readily as we're doing one of the cleaning techniques.